On January 4th, a family vacation on board the Norwegian Bliss turned to the Andersons' worst nightmare. A God moment where his grandpa, who had been an EMT, was was literally just happened upon the scene as I'm doing, doing compressions, and he, he runs right over. Noah and his younger brother Ryan had run down cruise ship stairs playing. Then Noah collapsed. We just ran up to him and... Um, um, pulled him out and um, he wasn't breathing and Noah was laying at the bottom of the stairs lifeless Grant said for the first hour he wasn't sure if his son would make it I mean he was gone at one point I mean it was I mean the, it was it was it was not good that's when Grant's father-in-law came on the scene while he was out on a walk and there's my father-in-law right there ready to give him ready to get breath, something like this, I mean, totally God moment. Not only had Noah's grandfather saved his life, he'd also performed CPR on Noah's mother after she went into cardiac arrest when she was 12. My father is, has said he's very tired of doing CPR on his own kids. <laughs> he's ready to be done with that in his life. And here's Noah himself, who doesn't remember what happened that day, but he's grateful to be alive. I remember having pizza, jello, and fries for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> and having a big bowl of ice cream and sprinkles. And then I don't remember anything else. There you go. And Noah has a genetic heart condition. He will undergo surgery tomorrow in Miami to have a defibrillator put into his left shoulder. The family says that they are overwhelmed by the support and prayers. Reporting live here in studio, Ashley Kirkland, WLWT News 5.